Maybe not, but it was certainly like impressive. <laughs> I'm really tired. Ow. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so, things settle back down at camp. The night returns to normal. Pro I assume you probably remove the dead wolves from the middle of your camp. Yeah. Um, someone should see to Sven's wound. Yeah. It got you pretty good before. Ah. I, um, I'm sorry, I didn't wasn't able to stop that. So I'm going to I'm going to assume Alva has healing and that yeah uh, yeah I think Alva has healing either healing word or cure wounds. Well, I mean, yeah, Probably druids can yeah. Choose, Probably both. But, yeah, that's true. But I, I mean, you're you're gonna be finishing up a long rest anyway, and you yeah. didn't use any magic the day before, so. I could also give Sven a really good pep talk. That, go ahead. <laughs> give Sven a pep talk. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So yeah, Sven maybe maybe have a, may have a resistance to pep talks. I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> She's vulnerable to a lot of things and resistant to pep talk. <laughs> resistant to pep talk. I mean, Sven doesn't seem to take pep talks as like pep. <laughs> I got this, I got this, I got this, I got this, I got this. No, nope, nope, nope. Don't worry, Sven, you're stronger than you give yourself credit, and you're tougher too, and a small entry like that isn't gonna slow you down any. And I'm going to use, use Rally to spend a superiority dial die to heal you for nine damage. Yay, nice. here he is. I feel like Sven is just like the living embodiment of the this is fine. <laughs> and Sven is just like oh, after like completely like over overheals her. She's like that the like rose starry eye. Like whoa. <laughs> <laughs> the spinning star is like ah. So um you, you know, you, you eventually get yourselves back to sleep. Oscar and Alva finish their watch. The rest of it is uneventful. Um, and it appears that, uh, so is, um, is Mark's watch. At least he didn't wake you up for anything, so you assume as much. And dawn comes. You've rested, you've restored what you used in that fight, because it was, yeah. it didn't, it wasn't long enough to break your long rest. Yay! Good. Yay, good. I get my hit points back. No L magic surge yet. Yes. Yeah. Yet. Though if that if that battle had lasted much longer, you would have had one. Yeah, I figured. Because I I know you wanted to have them sometimes, so I'm trying to remember. But you killed those wolves. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. And scared that wolf shitless. Fuck them, they're ouchy. <laughs> Um, so, the next day dawns, and I'm going to leave it up to you guys if we want to continue or we want to call it a night. I can't continue too much longer, but like up to a maximum of an hour more I could do. Mm. Uh, I'm fine mm. with either. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, well, let's continue a little bit further. Maybe we can get you to Velaki. Okay. Okay. Um, All right. Just because then you're in a town. <laughs> <laughs> um, we could do right, town so... things, like spend all our hard-earned monies. Yeah. You, you get yourselves together <laughs> and set off again, continuing towards Velaki. Um... So you walk along uh, you notice all of you notice right beside the road a gravestone um, <clears throat> and what looks to be fresh dirt. What do you want to do? 
Can stay the hell away from that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I just kind of take a look at it. I don't want to. Just okay. get close enough to kind of read the headstone. Okay. If there's anything written on the headstone, I don't want to like. Um, it. <laughs> just randomly along so, the side of the. So you read the headstone. It reads. Here lies. Mayette. I'm not reading this aloud, FYI. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You just continue on not, not saying anything? I'm just gonna... Yeah. So okay. what did it say? Nothing. Must have been some mm. unfortunate traveler. Yeah, probably didn't have time to give it a heading. Yeah. Well, let's continue on. <laughs> okay. Sucks being if I look back, is it still there? Um, if you look back, there is still a grave there. Uh, however, the it looks much older than okay. it did when you were close. It looks very weathered, as if it's been there for <clears throat> years. Whereas before, it looked fresh. I hate vampires. <laughs> Who doesn't? <laughs> oh, I don't valid, have valid enough question. experience with them to hate them yet, but I, I think I'm heading that direction. Yeah. <laughs> Give it time. Um, so you continue on. Mostly the road looks pretty normal. Um... But, uh, maybe a, a couple hours before, I lost the video for a couple of you guys. Mm -hmm. We lost, well, I oh. lost video for you. You're I'm reconnecting. Black yeah. Yeah. Um, there we go. Okay. Uh, I still can't see you. Oh, yeah. well, I can see all of you now. Mm. Yeah. Um. So, maybe a couple hours for sunset. And you, you're you starting to see the roads a little more traveled. You're, you've been heading, you start, you've just turned west. And the road seems a little more traveled. You're, you're walking, uh, there's, there's, there's trees, there's forest off the side. But every now and then you see a glimpse of what looks like a large lake um, to the north. And uh, Ismark says... That uh, that is Lake Zarovich. Um, <clears throat> it doesn't look like you're going to make it to Velaki tonight, but All right. <clears throat> Mark and Irina seem to think that it won't be too much longer in the day. Um, they're concerned about continuing since they can't see once mm -hmm. the night falls. Um, right. And then, yeah. just as night falls, oh, great. you roll, everyone roll perception for me. Uh, 15. At 20, so 23 total. Okay. 24. Okay. So all of you... Uh, it's not hard to spot. <laughs> you know, unless you were just not paying Trying a lot of shoes. attention. Yeah. <laughs> um, because it's a horse that appears to be floating in midair. And on top of it sits a man. Um, okay, yeah, hand is on rapier. He looks something the like trying to see if I can get that. It's a hard it's hard to get a good I can't you can't see, see you, don't worry about it. Yeah. Um, but I can't see you at all actually. Yeah. Okay. I can see it. I got <laughs> I it on video you at least. Are. You guys just uh -huh. didn't want you guys to see me. <laughs> as long uh, as Aaron's video yeah. works. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. 
It's, it's, it was a little hard to see it. It's a dark picture anyway. But it's a man. He's richly dressed. Um, pale. Dark hair. Immediately hiding behind my ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's it. Oscar's got, you know, one hand. Just kind of casually got, you know, resting her hands on on her rapier. But it's definitely loose. In the and, and he... You dare to steal my bride. <laughs> and Irina Man lets out, like, a sound of terror. Oscar is stepping in front of Irina. <laughs> and not taking her eyes off of floating vampire man. <laughs> People aren't <laughs> objects that can be stolen. We simply chose to escort Irina somewhere else because she asked. She is mine. She's not yours. People she is my Titania. <clears throat> Her name is Irina. Strahd gives you, he gives you a look, and you're, you've already guessed what this, who this is. Um, but he gives you a look of just utter disdain, like he's looking down his nose at you. Um, and he looks at Sven, and he looks at Alva, and he looks at Oscar. Interesting. Um... And I want everyone to roll initiative. Oh, fuck! Fuck. Oh, not good. I can't 13. roll initiative tonight. Ugh. 11. Uh, 8. Okay, so hold on. 13 for... Mayat. Mayat. Uh, Oscar, you said eight? Yes. Eight. Sven? Eleven. Okay. One second. Um. Where is what I'm looking for? Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. So he takes um, the first attack and um, hold on. I'm trying to find two things here real quick. Oh come on, I know. Sorry, hold one second. <laughs> the thing I need is hiding from me. Just to clarify, he is undead. He does. He counts as an undead, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I just wanted to make sure he wasn't Empire. like weird in that way. But no, okay. he is. He is cool. an unfreaking dead. <laughs> um, that's like second level undead. That's <laughs> as I we're basically fighting Dracula. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. Uh. Okay, um, but you also know you you hear um, both Irina and Ismark. Irina's terrified, but she has a she had a sword, and anyone who's looking at her, her hand is on her sword, mm -hmm. even as she stands behind Oscar. Um, <clears throat> Ismark steps forward, flanking Oscar with his own 
sword. Uh, and I can I just like as soon as he steps up, I think Oscar is just gonna lean over to him and just be like, "If this goes south, take your sister and run. Don't look back." He nods at you. Um. So Strahd gets the first attack. Um, and he is going to start by uh, uh, casting Ray of Frost at Oscar, who is standing in front of his <laughs> Yeah. Uh, cool and beefy. I got <laughs> and I, I have to pull up. Like I have to pull up spells because now that we've gotten to this point in the thing, one d eight and have halves movement if it hits. Yeah, Something yeah, like it's that, yeah. uh. Spell attack. Uh, I was mostly double checking that it was ranged oh, spell attack yeah. and not a saving throw. Not a save. Um, so what is his okay yeah that is a 20 to hit yeah um and it is 1d8 so two damage, two ice damage. Okay. Uh, and your speed is reduced by 10 feet to the start of your next turn. Oh. Um, and then uh, it is going to be uh, Mayette's turn. Okay, how close is he to me? Uh, he is floating on a horse in the air. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was going to say, uh, how high up is he? Uh, how high up is he? <laughs> Probably about 20 feet or so. All right. Let's look at what I can do. <clears throat> I can throw my spear. I was going to say that. Okay. Or I could. I'm actually going to start by throwing a hand axe because if I hit with my spear, then I have to lose my spear in him. <laughs> <laughs> Unless he much, throws it back at you. <laughs> much less attached to my hand axe. Um, you might want some uh, ranged weapons here. <laughs> yeah. That's what Sven is for. <laughs> I mean, I do have a crossbow. And Alva, I assume, but Alva's not here. Yeah. Oh. Um, I'm actually going to say that, that, that Irina. I mean, for the sake of this, I'm going to say that <laughs> Irina actually has a bow and arrow, okay. as well okay. as her sword. That way, someone has a ranged yeah. attack. I mean, I've got three ranged attacks. <laughs> <laughs> Just start throwing shit at him. <laughs> I've got two hand axes and my spear. <laughs> then okay, I'm so out you, of ranged. Attacks. You throw a hand axe. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. Throw a hand axe. It misses. Okay. But that's good. That means I can go retrieve it. Because it right. falls back to the ground. So you go retrieve your fallen hand axe and Straw chuckles at you. Like, you know, you know that, that sound uh. of like, you know, a parent who's amused by a child you know, an adult who's amused by a child's attempt at doing something. Yeah, you want to come down and fight me on the ground? It won't go as well for you. All right. Do I um, have enough move to make sure I'm within five feet of Oscar and Sven? 
Yeah, yeah, you can be within five feet of them. All right. Stay um, around me. I can protect you with my shield as long as you're around me. Uh, okay. It is now Ben's turn. Okay. This is just fucking terrifying. <laughs> she is like very hesitant to do anything at him, but if anything, her fear manifests magic in this case and chaos bolting at him. Yeah. <laughs> enough to like maybe him up. distract him enough that they can run away. Um And I dropped my thing. Of course I dropped a thing. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is scared of the vampire, too. Yeah. Um, did the 18? 18 does hit. Um, so that is... One, two... Um... So, 10 force damage. Okay. So, uh, there's another chuckle. <laughs> the kitten has claws. <laughs> I, I like you, kitten. Oh, no, no. <clears throat> I like you too, kit. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so it's not just terrible people. So, uh... Oh, I thought you were saying that at Strahd. <laughs> no. Me too! <laughs> that could be glorious! <laughs> but more something Alva would do. <laughs> um, I mean, if he had said that to me, maybe, but... <laughs> <laughs> mm. So, uh, is, is Mark only has his sword and he uh is just sort of taking a firm stance but in front of Irina because there's not much he can do he can't really throw the sword that that wouldn't work very well um he but he does say you will not take my sister and Irina on the other hand you know she as I said she has a bow and arrow. So she actually steps out a little <clears throat> bit to take a shot. Her hands are shaking and she's she's uh, quite frightened, but she goes ahead and takes a shot. Um, and that is not going to hit. Your hands are shaking and the arrow goes wide. Um, the that puts us at Oscar's turn. Okay. I believe in you, Oscar. Yeah. All right, Phil. I'm uh, I'm going to draw my hand crossbow and uh, let me just do this. I'm going to do that again. Um, uh, use right of the dawn, my new ability. Ooh, the crossbow, so it does radiant damage. Ooh, fancy. And nice. I'm going, yeah. And now I'm going to take a shot at Strahd with the hand crossbow. Okay. Uh, that is 24? That so hits. Let's see. Yes, 24. If it's, if it's, it's hits. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it was a natural 18 <laughs> plus 6. So. All right, that is... Okay, uh, that is... Uh, 5 piercing damage, and actually I think this, the damage is over. Uh, three radiant damage. Okay. 
He gives you a look. Just looking him dead in the eyes as I do it. Very interesting. Um, Why don't you come down here and find out how interesting I really am? See, that's what I'm saying. They don't know me either. They don't know me either. Uh, the 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 damage. starts to heal um though a small a small amount of damage remains uh so you've you've made a small small dent in strad uh, but let's go let's go he seems let's go, let's to be go. healing himself um and he looks at irena and her shaking hands and smirks and says Come to me, my Titania. And she looks at him and says, Oh. And her bow lowers. <clears throat> and she takes a step. I say, are, are we still in combat? Can I grab her? Towards Strahd. Can, can Oscar just like reach out and grab mm. her? <laughs> no. I will. I will allow that because you are literally right in front of I'm her, right next to her. And like, as a reaction, as a reaction, just be like, nope. Yeah. Um, it uses your reaction, but you can grab her. She yeah. stops and looks at you and says, "Why? Why are you? Why are you stopping me?" And Strahd smirks and says, I "Don't want to do this." You don't want to come be my bride. And it is Mayette's turn. Hmm. Should I knock Irina out so we can carry? <laughs> if you don't if you don't, I'm gonna try to knock her out on my turn. So uh, <laughs> I was thinking that or I was gonna try to hold person on her. Yeah. I, I'm going push to try to smack, smack Irina with the butt of my spear. Oh yeah, push comes to shove, I can try to bind her. Okay, you're going to smack her with the butt of your spear. Uh, non-lethal, obviously. Yeah. Uh, uh, 25. <laughs> uh, that hits. Nine damage. And with that, she goes down. I mean... Oscar still has her. I mean, yeah, still has can I kind of like so she, holding, <laughs> holding her? Holding her out. And Ismark is just looking around like, I d- don't know what to do. And Strahd? Strahd glared. <laughs> uh, and moves suddenly, quickly. Right up to Mayette. Whoa. He's now right there. Uh, Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Fuck you, it's not your turn. What are you doing? <laughs> You're fighting a vampire. I say, yeah. <laughs> fighting a super powerful <laughs> vampire. <laughs> he glares at you. I mean, like, you know, you know that death glare? Where, you know, it's really an if looks could kill type of look. Yep, I, I know that one. That's the look that's on his face right now. Um, and that makes it Sven's turn. Oh, yeah, the money gets away. Don't hurt my head. Uh, d- d- uh, f- uh, 15? Okay, uh, 15 does not hit. Okay. Um, it then, just misses. Then she's gonna quicken spell uh, Chaos Bolt and okay. try to Chaos that because, oh my god, don't hurt my Um, 22. So... Uh, 
Um, so, just suddenly, like, just, like, swing your hands around, and suddenly a blam of, uh, lightning strikes down at him for... Ten what was the hit? Ten lightning damage. It was 23. <clears throat> okay. With the Tides of Chaos. Mm -hmm. So ten lightning damage? Yep. Okay. Um, and... Arena is out cold. Um, <laughs> Ismark takes... Steps towards Strahd. I, he's... he's terrified uh but takes a step towards strahd and swings uh with his s s rapier and hits uh, for seven damage and he, he sort of yells something somewhat incomprehensible about his sister and how Strahd can't have her. The words don't actually, like, flow together in any logical order. It's sort of like, sister, no, you can't have her! Can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sven knows that feel. <laughs> it, it's, um, you know. That was basically just Sven, like, a second ago. Like, you know, yeah. give me boom! <laughs> <laughs> um so so he hits uh and that makes it Oscar's turn. Okay. Um <clears throat> can, yeah. All right. I'm still holding Irina. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um if I want to like basically just kind of shove her into is Mark and just be like, just get her out of here. Would that okay. be an action? I'll let you so shove is. Irina to Sh Ismark shove Irina to Ismark. for a bonus action, I guess. <laughs> okay. Um, mm. Ismark mm. uses his reaction to catch her. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Ismark catches her. Uh -huh. I don't. And like clings to her. Uh -uh. Okay. Mm. I'm trying to figure out if I can still switch my crimson right to my sword. I don't think so then. Because it's a bonus action. Yeah, I to use that. don't think you can... I mean... Yeah. So I, got rid of I, I, will, I will give you a choice because it doesn't. There's no real set definition of what throw, shoving someone at another human. Use yeah. your move action to shove. I could, yeah, I'd say I yeah. could. Could I use my move? Say that's my movement is to like shove her. Yeah, yeah. That uses all your movement. But yeah. all my movement. Okay, that's fair. Um, and then I'm just gonna drop my crossbow and draw my rapier and activate right of the dawn. On the rapier, okay. which is another. Actually, I think that's the same because I'm dropping the one right. Okay. Um, but I still take the damage. Ooh. <laughs> Fuck. Ow. <laughs> I, I just rolled a four on the damage die for that for myself. Oh. <laughs> so let me know when you're hurting. I'll give you a good I'm, rallying speech. I'm good. I'm not at half, half yet, but all right. And I'm going to use uh, attempt to stab that Strahd with my rapier now, now that he is I, within reach. Within reach. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we're kind of. You're right near my at, so I'm going to. I'll grant. Yeah. We don't have a map, so I'll just grant you. Yes, he's within reach. Nope. That's a one. Yeah, no, you uh, no. you try to 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 hit Strahd, and you just sort of like there's just a lot going on. Right Irina's feet and a rock and uh. <laughs> might happen. Um, you know, I was so focused on getting her out of the way and making sure that was more important. Yeah. Uh, All right, that's cool. 
so he once again and yeah oscar's hand is now just like dripping blood because yeah <laughs> Stroud once again appears to heal somewhat um as he glares at all of you and considers for a moment says you won't keep her from me forever you know <clears throat> you won't be around forever yeah. so we'll just keep her from you until you're dead <laughs> <laughs> you think kittens like you could kill me You think kittens aren't dangerous? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You think we're kittens? Let's go, let's go, let's go. There are nothing. Kittens is generous. Go. You're ants. Let's just go, let's just go. Let's and go. with that, he vanishes and appears back up on his horse. Uh, ants can still kill. Let's just go, let's just go, let's just go. Let's just go. <laughs> Ray raises his hand, and suddenly, ten wolves appear. And Strahd, on his weird flying horse, starts to fly away, laughing. This won't stop us! Let's go, let's go, let's go, run! <laughs> The go. wolves growl at you. Go, go, go. How many? They're surrounding <laughs> us, I assume. There's what, ten. There's ten of them. Yeah. That's a lot. We should. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. <clears throat> these, are, these appear to be regular wolves. They're not like the dire wolves. They're smaller. Still a lot of them. Yes. Mm. <laughs> um, not great on him. But at least they're not giant wolves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, they're not right on top of you yet. They, they... Um... So. Right. <clears throat> I guess I'll turn to Ismark and be like, can you carry her? Or do you need one of us to? Alright, let's I go. I can. <clears throat> and he hefts her into her, her, his hand. It takes him a moment to find his balance, but then he's set. Let's go, 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 go! Push, push, push! Uh, Alright, so we're starting to run. Yeah. I'll bring up the rear. I'm bringing up the rear. <laughs> so much rear! <laughs> this is really awkward standoff! While Sven is pushing people! <laughs> <laughs> the wolves the wolves growl at you, but don't seem to stop your departure. Alright, fine, I'll stick close to his mark then. <laughs> we don't have time to argue about this. Alright. Yeah, the wolf yeah, the wolves growl and howl at you, but once Strahd is out of sight, make mo no move to attack. And eventually, as you as you leave, as you get further away, they start to slink off into the woods. How did that happen? How did that happen? How did that happen? How did that happen? Just like crying, just like they just went face to face with people called the actual literal devil. <laughs> Just like bowling. Is Mark still holding Arena says I hate I I'd say we should push on but uh, don't appear to be that close to town. 
it may be more dangerous to travel at night. I do have torches if we want to push on. But if you want to make camp and tend to Irina, and I apologize very much for that, but... It, it's, it's, it's all right. I, I don't know what witchcraft he used, but... He's a vampire. They can do that, unfortunately. Some of them. I'm just hmm. glad she didn't leave with him. <clears throat> yeah. I hate to have to fight too. Yeah. It, I mean, yeah, it, it may be easier to defend ourselves if we camp. No, find a good camp. Find a good spot. Okay. Uh, I guess every, if everyone's looking for a spot to camp, uh, Sven. You had the highest investigation. Roll investigation for me in your frantically crying mode. Is With it survival? For helping. I'll say as, uh, I mean, my survival is even worse. <laughs> or no, my I mean, survival is better. My, my survival is three, which is the same yeah. as Sven's investigation. I have a six I, survival. <laughs> okay, well then roll survival. Because actually, yeah, roll survival for a good place to camp. Because Sven really wants to fucking is... live, so surviving is great. <laughs> uh, While this is going on, Oscar's um, just like wrapping up her hand with a bandage for now. So 13 plus 6, 19. Okay, 19. All right, so it, it doesn't take you too long. You actually find what, you know, you find a spot where there's a rock with a, a big, large rock with a bit of a curve to it. It's not like a cave, um, but it looks like you can probably set up with your backs to the rock, so nothing can sneak up on one side of you. Um, and so you've got a little bit of shelter. It's like, I found it. We got something behind you. It's everything's all over you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible things uh, can't sneak up on you. Is Mark lays Arena down and rubs a hand through her hair and then over his face. I hate to suggest tying her up, but until we know for certain <clears throat> that she's no longer under Strahd's control, it may not be a bad idea. Oh, that makes sense. He, I... his, his Mark closes his eyes, pained, and just nods. Do what you must. My it has rope. Yay. So yeah, I think we all have rope. <laughs> general adventurers kit. Yep. Okay. So you 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 tie up Irina. Um who who, you know, is 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 stable but still unconscious because no one has really bothered to wake her. Probably out of fear that she's still under strict yeah. control. Yep. <laughs> yeah. The only reason Ismark hasn't tried. Um, and Ismark lays her down and settles next to her. Alvi, can you look at Oscar? Oscar's really hurt. And I know you can heal. <laughs> so, Alva goes over and yeah helps take care of anything Oscar needs taken care of and you guys settle in and I think we should call it there yeah that makes sense because that's a good stopping point yeah <laughs> so you, you, you briefly fought a vampire and did not die <sighs> He chose not to kill us. That was nice of him. I say, yeah, he, he was toying with Good us. Good guy, Strahd. Uh, <laughs> no, God. He called you uh, kittens and ants. Yeah. <laughs> hey, ants are really strong relative uh, uh, to their body size. Also <laughs> still dangerous. Compliment. You know, potentially. <laughs> we'll swarm you, asshole. <laughs> hey, fire ant. I would say, yeah, you know, Oscar does have a flaming sword. <laughs> Like, surprise fire i'm a fire bolt. ant i'm a fire ant bitch well that was fun <sighs> i missed it <sighs>
And hopefully, you know, we'll, 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 we'll keep an eye out for time where at least three people can get together. Um, hopefully it won't be so long, but I think a lot of people's lives are settling out a little bit now. So after yeah. this weekend, yes. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, well, thanks guys. Thank you. Thanks for Ooh, running us. Yes. Always appreciate it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed your your creepy Sierra lady and your vampire. <laughs> always. Um, <laughs> always. Yep. Yep. <clears throat> and now I want to rewatch uh, Tons of Vampire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, just watch all the vampire movies. <laughs> all of them. No. Yeah, I, <laughs> just like, no, no, I need the show stopping number about garlic. I almost, I almost tried to do a terrible like Transylvanian accent and decided against it. Uh, yeah, that's fair. Yeah. <laughs> Just because a terrible Transylvanian accent would get really annoying eventually. Or you could, or you could give Thrud the jester voice. The jester voice. I, I, I would have to practice the jester voice, but I could, I could try. <laughs> um, yeah. I think a lot of the characters in this are supposed to be vaguely Russian, but yeah, sort of. Yeah. I don't have enough Russian to do like Stop. not have. I don't Stop have enough Russian. That. I don't have enough Russian accent skill to do like. It's like this is Igor in Igor, Russian and that is also sounds. Igor, and that Igor. person is yeah. also Igor. To have not every character no, sounds pronounced exactly. Igor. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> my name is Igor. But not blood. <laughs> and and over there, hi, I'm Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so I, I don't have enough accent skills to do any accent. Yeah, I need to. I, I at some point I want to try to do more voices, but it's it's hard to do in the moment. I have to come up with two new yeah. characters. I'm like, shit, I need more voices. It's like yeah. every every time you know, it's like every time I watch Critical Role, I'm just in awe in of, of, of Matt of Mercer's Matt right ability. Matt's I'm like, just fucking god, out of nowhere. Well, no, I mean, uh, all, of good, yeah. all of them could do do good voices in various instances, but, but like with Matt, with Matt just... Mercer, it's like he just switches between voices. Yeah, you know, yeah. constantly, and it's like how how like you know if I pick one voice and practice it a little, I could do a voice. <laughs> But it's hard to switch between yeah. ten voices. Really to be fair, is. he does get paid to do. I that. say, yeah, he does get paid I to know. do this. I, I am aware. But yeah, that's the only reason I don't feel still... utterly incompetent. Yeah. <laughs> he gets paid He's actually a professional. <laughs> this is his job. Yeah, I'm enjoying. I'm enjoying him. His his uh his his Yusuke in uh, Persona Five. Yes. yes. Yeah. It's very dramatic. Oh uh, yeah. Very good. Okay. And the fact that he does like all of the movie theater <laughs> over yeah, that's pretty great. I kind of wonder how many how many random voices he does in that game. A lot. So because, fucking many. Because Matt Mercer. Yeah. Um but yeah, I'm 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 enjoying it. I romanced Taru. She's adorable. Good. She She's a fluff princess. I romanced Makoto. Yeah, that was my first play. <laughs> if, if, yeah, I, 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 on my at first some point I plan through. to do a second play, in which case I will romance Makoto, I think. I do like On. But well, I'm half tempted sort of... to do the uh, romance everybody and just get the bad. <laughs> get the really and then just bad watch, Valentine's And then just watch the other cutscenes for everyone else. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, that's the thing. That's the one thing. I was like, I want to play on all of you. Yeah. <laughs> But if you do that, they all show up on Valentine's Day, and then yep. they're mad at you. I know. <laughs> um, I mean, to be fair, like, I get too many little sister vibes off of Futaba, so I don't actually want to Yeah, yeah same. And in general, like, especially the teacher, but the adults in general, I'm like, you're, 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 you're so much older than this character. <laughs> Yeah, the closest yeah. was yeah. Chihaya for me, so I'm like, oh, yeah, I was okay. Chihaya, yeah, say Chihaya, Chihaya the least. Like, Chihaya, I think yeah. would be the easiest, like, the, the... Cause she's not that yeah. much older. Yeah. Just the one yeah. thing that got me is that her English voice seems better for me than her Japanese voice. And I've been playing it in Japanese. Like her Japanese voice is very much higher than um, yeah. I was expecting. And obviously Haru's is surprisingly lower than. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I swear, every time Haru, Haru says "my lady," I hear "melody," and I'm like, "That that." <laughs> yeah, my lady, my lady. Um, but yeah, Tip it's good. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm up to uh, I'm up to Cheeto's palace, lady. Oh, yeah, Just you're pretty started. far in the game. Yeah, no, I've been. Well, I mean, I got I got sick for a while there, and basically did nothing but play Persona Five. Yeah, <laughs> because like I need, when I was awake, I needed something that required like some level of involvement on my part, so I didn't just end up staring at a wall. Um, and Persona Five was actually like really perfect for that. <laughs> um, yeah. So I got through a whole lot. You know, when I was sick for a week because I wasn't doing anything <laughs> else other than eat, sleep, and work. Yeah. So. It's been good. And I need to get critical role. Yeah, yes. I was able to knock out a couple episodes on a trip to Ohio. So. Nice. Nice. So now I'm I... just like four behind. <laughs> Yeah. Well, I was I was like five behind, and then I got caught up, and now I'm back a couple episodes behind, and I'm like, one of these days I will. No, I won't. Because I've been the problem to keep is, on that. as much as I want to yeah. stay up and watch it live, I I know it's a terrible idea. Yeah. And yeah. There's, a, there's that, that's actually like... the one advantage to being behind is then I can't really. <laughs> yeah. like, like if I can, I'm more likely to end up staying up until two in the morning and hating myself at work the next day. Um, yeah. I've just been fine doing that because I know it's the only way I'll be able to keep up with things and not go way too crazy behind. We just yeah. need to convince them to move to the East Coast. Yeah, yeah. like if if I lived if I everyone lived moved in for Ashley. Of, <laughs> if I lived in less of a constant state of tired then one night a week of doing that wouldn't be a problem. But because yeah. I'm always really tired, one night of extra tired just makes me, like, <laughs> almost non-human half the time. And I can fake the fact, I can fake not being tired when I'm like that, but it's not fun. <laughs> yeah. And I have to work, so. So someday, someday, why is Critical Role on the West Coast where I have yeah. to stay up until, you know, the wee hours of the morning? But at least I do have, I do have the Amazon Prime Twitch nice thing. Where it's always good. My Twitch, you know, my, my premium subscription is free through my Amazon account. So like, I can watch the video on demand whenever I want, mm -hmm. which is nice. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I have yeah, to wait until I either put it on YouTube or a podcast. I mostly do the if I'm behind, like actually like legitimately behind, I mostly use the podcasts because, you know, I can listen to an hour or 45 minutes in metro, yeah. on Metro mm -hmm. or in the car or while loading the kiln at the pottery studio. Yeah. <laughs> Um, which I do a lot of <clears throat> because if I'm not at the pottery studio, the kilns don't get loaded. It's a problem. No. <laughs> um, but okay. well, I need to go to the bathroom, so I'm 